Hello friends, let's understand the ultrasonic sensor first. So the ultrasonic sensor has four pins. There's VCC, which is for power. The one all the way to the right is GND, which is for the ground. And the middle two, trigger and echo, are, is for the transmitter and the receiver. So the transmitter sends high frequency sound signals. And if something comes in its way, the signal will be reflected back and it will be received by the receiver. Okay, right over here. So based on the time taken for the signal to travel and speed for the high frequency sounds in the air, the distance will be calculated. So in our program, we won't calculate it manually. We will just use a library for that. So now I'll put it up on the board. So let me just quickly explain the connections real quick. So of course here's the red, red wire, which is for the power. The black one right here is for the ground. And the yellow and green, which is the middle to a trigger and echo, is goes to the analog pin, as you can see there. So now, let's quickly test it out. So, let's say this is the object you want to secure, and this is the ultrasonic sensor. So if we move this object, and if the distance between the ultrasonic sensor and the Rubik's Cube is increased, and is greater than five centimeters, then the LED and the buzzer would both turn on. Let me give a quick demo. So that is a completed security system using the ultrasonic sensor. Thank you guys for watching.